Check one, two, check one, two. What is up, guys? Here with us, your boy Kagi, back at it again with a new video. And in this video, I bring you a tutorial on Arbitrum. So, we're gonna add Arbitrum to our MetaMask wallet. We're also gonna buy an NFT and we're also going to bridge money into the Arbitrum ecosystem now now as far as i know the arbitrum ecosystem in reality is used more for DeFi, but i still want to buy this pfp because yeah i just want to buy it so here we go all right so our goal right here is to buy this pfp we need 0.45 ethereum we gotta put it into the arbitrum ecosystem now i'm using this website called tofunft.com apparently this website is a marketplace with many many chains and of course it has the arbitrum chain all right, so the first thing you're going to need is a MetaMask wallet. If you guys don't have a MetaMask wallet, then you're an absolute noob. Make sure you check out the link down below and check out how to get into MetaMask. If you have a MetaMask wallet and you want to add Arbitrum into your MetaMask, you're in the right spot. This is how you create a wallet. Very, very simple. So you want to add right here a new network. As you can see, I have Arbitrum, I have Polygon, I have Avalanche. I already added Arbitrum. So you want to add new network and it's going to take you to this page right here where you can see see all of this network name new rpc chain id currency symbol you want to input this information now you're gonna grab this information from this medium article which i'm gonna leave the link down below you're gonna get this information and you're gonna input it right here once you do that now you have the network in your metamask that's it you created a wallet it's the same wallet as your ethereum because it's compatible with ethereum all right, so the next step is to bridge money into the Arbitrum ecosystem. So as you can see, I have 0 0.095 Ethereum. I don't have enough to buy the PFP, but I do have enough in my Polygon. Now, with the Arbitrum bridge, you cannot go from Polygon network into the Arbitrum network. You can only go from ETH mainnet into Arbitrum. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to use another bridge, which is called Seller. And this one does allow me to go from Polygon into Arbitrum. We're going to do that right now. So I'm going to go ahead and put my 0.46 into Arbitrum Nitro. Boom. We're going to confirm the transaction and that's it. All right, ladies and gentlemen. So we got the money on Arbitrum 0.46. Now the NFT that I'm going to buy is from Blueberry Club. This is a club for traders. I'm not really a trader, but you know, let's go. Let's go. Discover our ecosystem. GMX Blueberry Club. GMX Blueberry is a collection of 10,000 NFTs living on Arbitrum that are made up of 130 hand-drawn trades. The Blueberry Lab is a tool that allows GBC owners to customize their berries with new attributes, which must be owned on chain pretty sick that's actually pretty sick gbc trading redistribution system that allowed gbc members to open leverage position on gmx with our treasury yield puppet mirror trading oh social trading platform for investors actually this has a lot of utility let's fucking go all right so here we go we got the money now we're just gonna press buy boom accept buy here we go our first nft on arbitrum Perfect. Got my NFT, ladies and gentlemen. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys got some value out of this video. And if you did, make sure you like, make sure you comment, make sure you subscribe to the number one NFT gaming channel in the world. And I'll see you guys next video. Peace. If you guys enjoy our content, make sure you guys follow us at the Juice Gaming Team on Twitter. And if you guys want to stay up to date with Web3 Gaming News, make sure you guys follow Juice Gaming News on Twitter. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next video.